Hey guys, what's going on? It's me Insightful again here with a, another gold farming video. Guess what? It's another skinning farm. This is one of the fastest ways to get Borean leather. To my knowledge, you can do 10 runs in 20 minutes. So let me show you the route I do and then let's see how much we've earned in those 20 minutes. Enjoy. So once you're in guys at the entrance and you can start seeing all these snakes, the route we're going to do is really simple. You're going to come down here, kill a pack of snakes here, come here, collect all the cobras or snakes, whatever you want to call them in this area, kill them, skin and skin these and then run out and we will do the run in under two minutes so make sure you have your charge vial of alacrity and your dark moon fire water just for optimal time min minimization and let me do the run with a time counter on and let's go so first of all we're gonna collect these up we're gonna want to use our speed boost like we always do for those of you that watch me regularly, you know how we run this. And then what we're going to do as we come in here, we're going to go to the right and we're going to use Soothe on these and we're going to collect up all the other snakes. You can literally jump in on the other cobras. Now, some people may be like, oh, I hate the fact that we have to jump in the water, but you're a druid for this farm generally. So it makes it a lot easier. And then when you come in the water, you want to make sure you save your underwater speed boost as a druid. Collect all these. I collect all four. And then all I do, I'll show you. I come up to here. Jump back in just to get the distance on. And then I kill them all on this middle one. So let them all come in, kill them loot instantly start skinning now you can sometimes kill them over there but what i've noticed is they some stay in the water and just kind of range attack you so i tend to go to that and then just jump to get the distance and then instantly start skinning so we're on one minute 20 you we are against the clock here i did say we would go for two minutes but i can promise you i've done this in two minutes many many times this is also a hundred percent one of the absolute best farms for Borean leather to my knowledge at the moment it's incredibly quick and obviously if we can do 10 runs in obviously between the time of travel you're probably looking at about 22 minutes and you're going to get around 50 leather per run for this so at the end of the 10 you're going to end up with 500 Borean leather so we're a few seconds late here but that's probably because I was trying to line the uh, Soothe on that first guy and that's just so we can pull them but you can see there we've easily done a run in two minutes and nine so what I will do now guys is I will finish up the ten runs and then I will meet you over in Stormwind and let's see how much gold we've made so guys we are over in Stormwind now it's taken me around, I believe, 22 and a half minutes to do those runs. I've also got some really nice BOE pieces of Transmog, which is really nice. And also, just a quick note, you can get the Raptor by doing Drac Far and Keep and killing the Raptors outside of the dungeon in between lockouts. So if you just want to do that, get a chance of the pet. The pet does sell really well, and it's a really cute little thing too. I may make another video about that. So let's see how much we've made and how many levers we've got. So in total, I am in the middle of doing another farm. So in total we have got from all of that we have got 1852 gold and then we've also got some transmog pieces so let's put these on i've not got um a transmog that tells me unique appearances but you can see from the prices of some of these that they're essentially really really quite high so like I say, not every gold farm needs to be an insane amount of gold. It can just be you've got half an hour to play, you want to optimize it in with another farm route, and you want some Borean leather, you want 450 to 500 pieces. There you go. And you can store it up, wait until, you know, it maybe goes for nearly 10 gold, because prices do fluctuate, although they are fairly steady. And 
like I say, just try and get like big stacks of it, like 5k, and then dump it on the auction house and just make some really quick gold. But this is just another really easy and quick skinning guide for you guys to make some quick gold and make some potential gold with some unique transmog items if you have enjoyed this video guys please do support the channel by hitting that subscribe button i know every youtuber says this if you can drop me a like that's also very much appreciated in the meantime be kind be peaceful and remember most of all you are appreciated bye